Starting lineups for Bo being announced with Charlie and I swap out spots. In that uh, number number one, Ben Carter. Starting on defense, Anders Norton. I'm assuming we're gonna announce a senior line maybe, but. Alex forward. Eleven is Ryan Doherty. And number nine, Matt Hosschild. Brooks Craig, number three at center. And in that, Parker Taylor. We'll pause for the national anthem. And there's our starting six for Concord High there, uh, out for the national anthem. And as it is senior night, and we have four seniors uh, here in the, the Family Hockey Support Group, Friends of Concord Hockey, have done a wonderful job with shirts and posters, and the fans have turned out. We got a great turnout here on a Saturday night, leap year day, February 29th. Charlie Russell for Concord TV. Peter Burgess. And we got the Bo Falcons down here, so uh, barring a major upset between uh, Londonderry beating BG, and we should have the results during the game. The Bow Falcons have grabbed the last, the 11th spot in the playoffs. And Concord has uh, cinched the first spot in the playoffs. Playoffs will be, first round will be next, next week, and then we'll be back here in a week on Saturday at 4 o'clock, where Concord will be playing the winner of the 8-9 uh, game. And then they'll go down to JFK for the semifinals, and they'll play the winner of the 4 5 8 9, assuming they advance. And then on Peter's birthday, March 14th, there'll be a big game, a state championship game. Uh, barring upsets, Concord looks to be one of the favorites there, but uh, that's why we play them, folks. Take it away, Peter. And Craig wins the opening draw for the Crimson Tide, and Norton sends it in. Covered up in the first whistle in seven seconds. Let's hope they don't make that. I can hear you. I can hear myself and you. I can so. hear you now, okay. It's the audio on this, it's not uh, great. Backhand, oh! Could have had our first goal 15 seconds in. Lost the puck, Craig down, and it carries in. Forward over, sends it around. Picked up by Doherty. Doherty lifts it. Hosschild. Hosschild back to Doherty and shot save. Tip tie. Yeah, don't be catching that puck. <laughs> Flipping by us, folks. Had a few up here near us this year, Peter. Nelson in a battle along the boards. And out with it. Bo. Nelson around. Drew can't clear. To Bo. Blocked. Cosgren picks it up. Sends it up to Ala. Ala carries it in. Backhand. Score! Hey! What a Joey shot. Joey Ala, minute and a half in. A scorer's shot. 
He likes that backhand. He yeah. likes to shoot a backhand. He, what, did he hit the top he inside hit it up corner? On the, yeah. So Conkin goes up. He likes one that nothing. backhand going in. Yeah, I don't know. I, I've seen him. 128 into the uh, game. Conkin, uh, Alla gets a partial breakaway. Shot. And leans in and backhands it past the uh, bow goalie. Offsides. Yeah, offsides. Kosker and I believe on an assist here. We'll a real shooter's goal. Ala is a sophomore. Shot from the uh, right point here. Now, uh, oh, I guess they called offside, huh? So 19 from 12. Battle along the boards, Bo comes away with it. And McGonagall, pass across, dumped Number in by O'Brien. Number six meal cars out there for Bo is one of their better players, the top scorers. Shot blocked, O'Brien sends it up to Craig, tips off the stick and back in, Nelson. Sends it up to Hoschild, settles the puck right on the line, score! Oh no, it hit the outside of the net, damn it. <laughs> well, when Matt has the puck. <laughs> Conkett settling it, and that hits. I think Philbrick and comes. Oh, Philbrick took the shot. Conga dumps in, goes for a change. Philbrick and Nelson leave the ice for Norton and forward defensively. And Bo brings it up the near side. Held up by Taylor, picked up by Norton. Norton to Hustchild uh, and up to forward who dumps it in. Bounces off the backboard. Picked up by Craig. Forward with a quick shot. And puck's still in front. And I, oh off, no, I hit the ref. The ref. <laughs> oh, they got a lucky shot there. That stopped the icing call. That was a clear icing. Don't call icing, icing on that one. They the didn't other make way. up on it. <laughs> yeah, that would have, <laughs> I mean, they just wanted to get it out of there. Well, there was, there's our score. Uh, Pretty warm up here today. I put a sweatshirt on. I'm a little, I'm a little, it's, I'm a little yeah, sweaty. Yeah, it's, it's a lot warmer <laughs> today. I got the scarf and three layers on, but. Usually, uh, it's pretty cold, but, but. Bo in. Forward with a good job of just pushing the man off the play. Yeah. Drew will skate over for it. And Norton. Across to Ala, the goal scorer, dumps it in. Drew down, Drew looking across to Koskren. Koskren sends it back, although Drew had gone to the center ice. Kept in by Nelson. Nelson and Philbrick in on defense right now. Second line on the ice for the Tide. Flipped up. Philbrick to Nelson. Hoskren tries to settle it. Dumped in. Now 
Nelson, shot, blocked. Tries to glove it down. And icing. icing. Nine forty-five to play. First period. Two shots on goal. First one went in for the Crimson Tide. What are they playing? Street hockey uh, down below at the foot of the stairs down there. <laughs> I don't Looks know. Like it. I can hear a lot of clanging, but and this one clears the zone. Forward will wait. Sends it in on net. Where is it? Oh, went right between <laughs> his pads. <laughs> Look what I found. <laughs> Look what I found. That thing just kind of settled in he, there. <laughs> he looked behind him, and it wasn't in the net, so it must be underneath him. <laughs> <laughs> you always wait for the see what the goalie does, because sometimes he doesn't even know. And forward again. That one ricocheted off and sits in the crease. It's been a couple of long shots by forward on that. Yeah, I, 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 I'm not sure he's uh, uh, focused on the puck as much as uh, most goalies are. Well, that one did ricochet off another player. So Played up to Norton in wide. Down in the corner. I got a penalty here. Hand pass. Hand pass. First line will come out for the tide. So you guys okay to pro do that down there? Yeah, you're not supposed to be playing in there. Somebody will get hurt. That's equipment room. We can hear it up here. Stop it. It's Charlie yelling. Charlie's uh, once again well, yelling not, at children. They're not thumping, but they're playing at the foot of the stairs. And I'm sh I see all sorts of signs. No playing street hockey in the arena. And that's what they're doing down there. Oh, in front. Poked away. Nelson's shot blocked. And a race. Philbrick, that hit the safety the net. net. Face off at center ice here. Hustchild in a race. Oh, he went down. To Philbrick, sent down. Bounced off the back of the net. Craig trying to skate through traffic. Nelson cheats down, it's at his feet. I don't think he knows. And Doherty over. Pinned to the boards, Craig joins him, and Bo comes away. Played to Craig, but cut down by Bo. Kept in, and now cleared. Craig to start it up. Hustchild cruising through center. Craig, yeah, he put yeah, himself offside. He, he pulled it back. Too, one cut too many, and the uh, left winger was over the line. Looks like both sides change up. We're going to have the face off on the far side. 7.20 left, first period. Conk it up, one nothing on a Joey Alla goal. Norton sends it in on net. Kick save. Oh, looking to break out, and that hit the Up safety the net. net. Draws a face off down there to the left face off circle. There's our 2020 balloons here. Shot, kick save. Backhand across. Shot. Score. There it is. 22, 22 Drew. Centering pass doesn't make it all the way across, but, but rebounds back to uh, 
22 who uh, I think was the one that made the pass across. Zach Drew. Hakon got up 2 0. 645 left, first period. I didn't see. Did you see you got the pass? Assist? I think I, I didn't see it. Yeah. I think uh, I think he got his own pass back. I think. Here we are. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, the assist should have went to the uh, ball player that cleared it back to him. Oh, here's a better shot of our 2020 over there. That balloon came around a little bit. <laughs> subject to a little bit of wind. Bo retreats behind the net. And picked up in front. O'Brien with a shot. Save. Brian Carter, the netminder, senior. Well, I would hardly call it. the Bo goalie a stand-up goalie. He goes down pretty quick, I'll tell you. He's on that ice trying to pick up those rebounds and cover the puck. Uh, that would hit the safety net. Up in the net. Have that face off down below. Conkett sends out Ryan Philbrick and who's that? O'Brien, number two. Nelson. Getting them confused all season long, folks. Score! What was that? Was that five? Five. Joey That's, Tarbell. Uh, Tarbell. Tarbell's on a scoring streak. That was uh, unanticipated on my end, but nice shot. <laughs> Well, he knows how to put the puck in the net. Okonka goes up 3 nothing, 6.06 also, <laughs> left. So. I think unanticipated on Mr. Carter's end, too, because he just let it fly by. So, Tarbell with a nice shot. Oh, yeah, well, hit that top corner. Drop back for Doherty. In front, oh! <laughs> that just jumped Craig's stick. Bouncing puck. Matt can't get there, and nobody. Poked by Philbrick, and he sends it away. Five and a half to play, first period. Three nothing, Crimson Tide. Bow in a hole here quickly against this Crimson Tide team is pretty strong. I can't remember a team this good that we've done in what, this is 16 years? Yeah, well, they, they do a lot of passing. Here we go. Tipped. I mean, that 2010 team was good, but they had really good goaltending that year. And Garrett, Garrett, wasn't that who we yeah, had that Garrett. year, Garrett? He did everything, including standing on his head to, to win that one nothing game against Exeter. Yep. And a freshman scoring the goal, <laughs> which was odd in itself. Mitchell Hayes. We've got a Hayes on this team, so that might be good luck. Yeah. 
So we're down about 420 left in the first period. Concord up 3-0, 9-1 to out shooting uh, the bow team. Kept in by forward. Norton sends it behind the net. Ala over, scored the first goal to get us started here. And I That'll iced. be icing if it's not on net. 3.15. McGonagall and O'Brien assists on the Tarbell goal. So, we just need the first line to score here and then all three lines will have scored. Kept in by Norton. Sent down to O'Brien. And that one gets by. As well. Three goals on nine shots. Less than three minutes to play first period. Shot by Hustchild high. Might have been tipped. Doherty sends it over. Home uh, run. Home run pass. Finally there to break it up. Nice play. I know it's warm in here. I don't know if the ice is that good. Yeah. Matt's gone down a couple times, nobody touching him, so. And Bo looks to break it in. They'll just dump and run. They'll change behind the play. Felbrick will pick the spinning puck up. Sent into the corner. Market changes up all four. Something smells good. It smells like grilled cheese in here. I don't know why. That's what it Nacho smells like. cheese, probably. <laughs> oh, nice glove save. Oh, sorry through a crowd. They probably make grilled cheese over there. Right? I think so. Yeah. They got a. They got a decent cafeteria. The prices are really reasonable. So. Couple 159 bucks. left here, 10 to 1. Concord out shooting Bo and up 3 nothing on the it's like less tickle, than tickle in the twine. Less than 3 bucks will get you some uh, mozzarella sticks. I think it's $2, $2.50, something like that. Forward has it blocked, picked up, and back. That clears the zone. 135 to play. First period. Nice little WWE elbow. <laughs> Forward, pass across. Shot behind the net. Oh, backhand, score! There it is, Drew gets a second goal of the period. A couple of backhand shots here. Yeah, they're beating him on the backhand, that's for sure. Zach Drew again. Junior. Drew looking for the hat trick early here with 115 in the first. If he could get another one, that'd be a natural, but uh, I don't think he's gonna be on the ice. Glove down by Nelson. Yeah, Bo, Bo played a game against Salem down there uh, and lost three to two. 
in Salem, but uh, Bo moved up from Division Two. They uh, won the championship within the last five or seven years in Division Two, and I think we're in the finals another time. But thirty-four seconds. Up, oh, Bo, maybe a breakaway. No, Philbrick there, drop back. Just want to clear it here. 22 seconds. Over, dumps it in. Craig, backhand score, Matt Hoschild. 2.3 seconds left, Hoschild buries it on the backhand. <laughs> beat them all with the backhand. So, Conker goes up 4 nothing, 5 nothing. <laughs> now it was uh, Craig intercepted a pass and passed it into uh, So it looks like we'll have running time here tonight, folks. Third period. Wow, great period by the Crimson Tide. All three lines scoring and uh So we're back for the second period here. Concord will be shooting to our left as per usual here and uh, got a pretty good turnout here for a double header. The girls will be playing later against number two. Uh, girls are in Concord girls are in first place, and the Bishop, they've clinched first place. The Berlin Gorham team is in second place, so we look like we're gonna have a lively game. Uh, I'll be here doing the game, and we might have a guest commentator, I don't know. Uh, but we'll see. Well, the girls' and game has been interesting. The last one we were waiting for, there was a lot of fights in that game. Yeah, yeah. So we'll see what happens here, but uh, so we'll see. Number 29 is going down. Is that our backup goalie? Charlie. Oh, that's Parker Taylor. Parker Taylor. Where have I you know been I, all year, sir? I know. I always get my, I know they're high numbered, but we, we sometimes miss a change in goalie, as more than one parent has told us. It's senior night. He's going nowhere. Yeah. Oh, that's it. Well, I think he's had eight shutouts this year out of their, 16 wins and he was uh, uh, I think he was second team all state last year so certainly looks like he's going to be all state this year. Conker dumps it in they'll be shooting to our left. Oh with any luck we get another goal and go to running time in the third period. Well Peter <laughs> My feeling isn't if, I think it's when. Concord has averaged uh, exactly seven goals a game in their f 15, 16 games, 17. I guess this is their 18th game, so maybe it's a little bit below seven. That's going to be icing. Waved it off. And Norton, I don't think he knew because he kind of held up there. Lifted, offside. Offside. Hustchild wanted to get that breakaway. He was a couple steps off. Yeah. The old high lob here. Well, he's a senior. He got a goal. Let's see. Uh, uh, no other seniors have scored yet. Five goals and at least three of them that I'm aware of are all on the backhand. So Yeah. Maybe this goalie doesn't uh, do well on the backhand and they know that. I don't know, but. Crossing the ice is Philbrick and takes it in. Cutting towards the net. Bell! 
Oh, he dropped it in the crease. Philbrick with a Oscarin shot, oh. save. Philbrick with a uh, great rush. I think that's Drew passed that puck. He should have shot it. He could have had a hat trick, but yeah. that's the selfishness of this team. They, they'll pass the puck. Yeah. Very selfless when they, when it comes to that. They, they play team team hockey. It's good to see. Looks like that'll be our scrum of the day, Peter, huh? I don't know, there's been some others. Picked up by Drew behind the net. Koskren will carry it in, surrounded by bow players. Ala to the net. Kept in. Koskren sends it across. Ah. O'Brien couldn't get the shot off. Had that side of the net open. And Parker Good Taylor. Strong shot from the second blue line. Second save of the game. <laughs> One in each period. There's our goalie right there, Parker Taylor. Senior night. I don't expect them to t be taken out of this game only because of that. You never know. Plus they have a they have a bye in the playoffs, so he's not going to get any action for a week. Yeah, that's true. Picked up by McGonagall. Drops it back. Joey Tarbell with a shot. It got Save through, but wide. Shea pulls it off the boards and chases it down. Kept in by Philbrick. Across to Shea, dumps it over. Trying to feed Hayes. Anders Norton down for the puck. Gets there first. Pass back to Drew. And across to Philbrick. Drop back for Shea. And it's tied up with the ref yeah. there. Just out of Shea's reach again. And he'll go to the bench. Across the Hayes, went through his legs. Donnelly looking taken down. And Bo ends up with the puck. Sorry, sorry, Doherty, not Donnelly. I don't know why I do that. I think we had a Donnelly at one point. Shot, save, Doherty all in traffic in front of the net. The puck's in the net. No, no, bad it hand, off. Bat, high stick. Yeah. High stick into the net. Gonna move it way down. Yeah, that, that puck was, that puck was up certainly well above the crossbar when somebody batted it. Us child in quick, high shot off the shoulder. Went for that inside corner. He was going for that corner, yeah.
tripped over the blue line. Ala from behind the net will start it up with a cross ice pass to Drew. Drew in, pulls it back. Pinned to the boards. Ala joins him, pulls it out. Norton back down to and across. Ala taken down briefly. Forward plays it down behind the net to Ala. And a penalty. Trip. First penalty of the game goes to number nine for Bo Cole Billow, tripping sophomore. So we'll get to see uh, Concord's power play up close here, right down below us. 9.06 left, 16 to 2, Concord out shooting uh, Bo. Parker wins the draw, picked up by Cosgren to Norton and back to Norton. Back to Cosgren, shot. Oh, he picked that one up. That was a nice save. Good save. I was well, waiting. I didn't see it. Wasn't too many years ago, Peter, these, uh, these uh, back, I guess, 25 years ago, they played on the same uh, team before Bo got their own high school. But a lot of these players have. Oh. Bid for the hat trick and denied. Over the net. Got a glove, got a glove on it. Oh, he did, okay. Yeah. No, my, no, not if not if they move it out here, Peter. It oh, it looked a, like he got a glove on yeah, it. Yeah, well, he flashed on it, but the refs didn't see it. Of course, we and know you got, you got better view up here than the refs, Peter, that's for sure. It looked like he got a piece of it. it okay. Went straight up. But. Power play. Bow with one four checker, three in. Norton pass across to Huschild. Tried the backhand deny. Oh no, that was uh 19. Joey Alla. Alla. All I saw was the nine. So Bo sets up three defensemen, uh, three uh, three across on the red line here. Here comes Alla down the far side, dumps it dumps in. Dumps it in. Koskren behind the net. Drops it back, Norton has Drew set up in front. Cosgren across, forward. Forward, wrist in, score! Jesus, he's so good from that spot. He, he picks up, you he's know. He's done that every game we've seen. You like, know, for years, Peter, we, we used to call those top corners. We used to call it Marceau's corner, but it's looking like uh, I, I saw him the other night with the adult, the Capital League, and I said, we're almost ready to rename those corners Hustchild or Forwards Corners. But Forward just drives it through, like at, like just under the shoulder. Yeah. From those two spots, either the left or right side, about I don't know what ten feet in from the blue so line. So that was a power play goal. There we go, dumped in. Oh. Bouncing in, it's pad save. Tarbell scored a goal. He's got the puck, sends it around to O'Brien. And Philbrick will just retreat here. Sent in by McGonagall. Philbrick cheats down. Trying to settle that puck. Ah, center, nobody there. Three on two, Conkett gets back. Tarbell, get there first. Tries to drop it over to O'Brien. Kept in, chopped down. Oh, stick around the neck. Backhand save. O'Brien. Yeah, it looked like almost like a hook. 
It's almost like a hook there, didn't it? Didn't get called. Oh, he is. He's calling it. He did. All right. High, High stick. stick. Oconco with another power play here. 6.48 left in the second period. So that last goal, Alex Ford assisted by Tyler Koskren and Anders Norton. Power play goal and maybe another one here. We'll see, we got 6.38 to play. Second period, six nothing already. Five goals in the first period. Didn't uh, get across that red line. Icing. So, Billo not having a good period. That's his second consecutive penalty. He's been in the box twice yeah. already this period. Well, 141 left on the penalty here. Allah from behind the net, send it around. Got a bad bounce off the boards there. Forward, sends it to Shea. Shea, Shea would like to get a goal here. Yeah, senior night. Yeah. Ala looking, Shea. Pass to Ala, cross to Fennelly and cleared. Five and a half to play, 40 seconds in the penalty, second period. Oh, oh I thought he was across the line. Calling that kind of close there. Well, they do have a six goal lead, Charlie. Yeah, well. And they're on the power play. Well, you called the high stick there before the refs did, or I didn't see the hand go up, but. Oh, nice. Hostchild able to take that right off the stick. Norton keeps it in. Feeds Hostchild. Philbrook back to Hostchild. The Doherty. Hostchild score! Second goal for Matt Hostchild. Fed by Doherty. Nice play. Power play Power goal. Power play goal. 7 nothing. Honk it up. Well, Concord scored just a little over their average there. I heard nine and 11. I didn't hear the other, the other assists. Twenty-three might, to three shots on goal. Might have been twenty-two. We'll see. Oh, not twenty-two. Uh. Like to see him get another goal. It'd be nice to see a hat trick on the senior night here. He's not a senior, but still. Well, what is he? Zach Drew will be a senior next year. I could see him being a team captain. Yeah. He's definitely got the the skill and the leadership for that. Shot blocked.
Shot, save. Koskren looking for one there. Koskren with the puck again. He feeds Fennelly. Fennelly sends it back down and around. Ah, oh, trying to refeed Koskren going through. A lot, a lot, a lot of room there. Running out of real estate. Koskren to the bench. Tarbell on the ice. Lifted out by Bo. Penalties expired. I don't know if you said that or not. Three minutes left in the second period. Conk it up, 7 nothing. And icing. Don't wave off the nope. icing there. Forward. Plays it out, just out of the reach of Joey Tarbell. So Huschild from Doherty and Norton. 9, 10, and Seventh 11, goal. huh? Well, 9, 11, 10, but yeah. yeah. <laughs> Philbrick lifts it. Oh, come on. That's the second time that's happened. 2-2-2 two, two, two in the second period. I tell you, the twos have been coming up a lot in the pick fours. Yep. Been playing those. Now we had what? 2-20-20-20. February 20th, we had three yeah, 20s was, in a row there. 2-22-20 and 2-20-20. Today being a leap year. Sadie Hawkins Day. Well, that means spring, spring has an early arrival this year on March 19th, but at uh, I think 11 something p.m. Usually the 20th. Although by the looks of the weather, we might have an early spring anyway. Oh, that one got by. Oh, they scored. Ah. Yeah, that looked like trouble the, the way. With a scramble and a two that on 13? two and the puck caroms to the no, 23. 23, Blake Scarinza. So 131 left in the second period. Freshman. Still a six goal deficit that'll uh, uh, go to running time. Yeah, that was ugly in front of the net. Well. out by Hayes and that one hit the safety net. Cup, cup, couple of freshmen get that goal for Bo. They have quite a few on their team. Clearly building for the future. Well, Bo was pretty dominant and when they were uh, in Division, division two. two, but. 
everything we heard when they first came up to Division I was that they were going to have a hard time in the beginning. Yeah, it was. And it wasn't a good year for them to do that. But. Oscar into Shea. Under, under 10 seconds left here. Back to Shea. Get a shot off, kid. Uh, finally. 7-1, so we will have running time for the third period. We'll be back for the third period. So we're back for the third period here. Concord is up seven to one over uh, Bo. And we'll run down the playoffs here. Concord will be playing um, by virtue of finishing first, although if one, two, five get first round buys, Concord will be playing it next on March 7th, 4 p.m. right here at Everett Arena. And they'll be playing the uh, eight Eight, the winner of the 8-9 game, which looks like it's going to be right now Wyndham, Pinkerton, or Hanover. And then the semifinals will be down at JFK Arena in Manchester. That'll be Wednesday, March 11th. And as the top seed usually plays first, uh, excuse me, plays the feature game, they'll be playing at 730 And then March 14th, I think it's a 5 o'clock game. The finals will be held at SNHU Arena, SNU Arena. I still call it the Verizon because that's the what Verizon, it was, yeah. but yeah, it's not anymore. So it's been uh, been a I while since uh, Concord has been to the finals. Uh, certainly they have to play a few good games to get there. They got some tough competition. Uh, Exeter has won about 10 in a row. Salem's won eight or nine. Both of them have lost to Concord. Actually, quite handily, they beat uh, they beat Exeter early on in the uh, season. I think the first game of the year down there. So take it away, Peter. Got, gonna have so running time running here. Time, so yep. a quick period. And Bo breaking it in. If they get below six goals, it'll go back, but. Well, they have to, it takes them, uh, I think they have to bring it back to within three or four. I don't know. Oh, is that what it is? Not just one Not goal just one. brings it back. Yeah, I think you're right. That would have brought Raid. Ooh. Yeah, the goalie looked at it. And They all fall down over yeah, there. Better going down. Philbrick plays it up. And icing. No, waved it off. Waved off. Ala there. Lost the stick. Sent in wide. Comes all the way out to Nelson. Nelson sends it up into the corner. Cosgren over behind the net. Drew sends it over. Ala. Philbrick back. Back to Philbrick. One time. And Bo dumps it in on net. And Parker Taylor will just settle on it. Five saves uh, for Parker Taylor. One goal given up here. He's still a net, obviously, because of senior night. But. Yeah, well, they won't be playing. Yeah, somebody pointed out, you or someone else, they won't be playing uh, Tuesday night. It'll be a week before he plays again.
O'Brien backhands it along the boards. And Bo sends it back the other way. Nice pass. And McGonagall into the zone. McGonagall backhand towards the net. Finally down for it. Pulled out by Concord. O'Brien plays it off the glass. Glove down by Fennelly towards the net. Chopped out of the air. And dumped in. Fennelly from behind the net starts it up. Pass to O'Brien and tipped in. Shea in with the puck. Norton, shot and a save. Norton with a couple assists today. Three of them. Yeah, well, Norton was down there for with his parents. He's a uh, senior. I remember him as a very small freshman and uh, certainly grew and matured, played some good, strong defense. Ah. Two guys with a chance for hat tricks. Neither one of them. Oh, there is one of them on the ice right now. Matt Huschild. Shot on net. Pretty hard to win a game when the other team has seven goals and you only have six shots on net. Yeah. Conquer, Conquer doing a good job of limiting those shots as usual. Save. Huschild picks up the puck behind. Ricochets off the glass. Ah. Craig. And out to Nelson. Dumped in by Fennelly. Craig follows the play. Craig will skate to the bench. Replaced by Ala. A little scrum there. Pulled out by Drew. Nelson over. Keeps it in. And Allah will pick this up at the blue line. Pass across. Fennelly skates it in. Stays with it. Press to the boards. Cosgren sends it around. Picked up behind the net by Bo. And a one-on-one -on -one here. Conquered for the moment tips it away. Sent around by Fennelly to Drew. Bo picks it, carries it to center. 7.47 to play. Very fast period for this running time. Twenty-eight to seven shots on goal for Concord, up seven to one. Five goals in the first and two in the second. No scoring here.
Backhand shot, O'Brien. And Dave he's made. got it. Yeah. Dave is made. Brian Carter, the bow netminder. 6.45 left. Oh. Well, forward back on a two on one pass. I think Tarbell got a piece of that. Yeah. I had an open man, but uh, deflected the timing on the pass. That's all it takes. Icing. No, nope. waved it off. Nelson sends it in. Concord going for a change. Oh, wide of the net. Shot front. That one hit the cross. I mean, hit the uh, post. Yeah, Went got a wide. piece of it. Good setup. Dumped into the far corner. O'Brien comes to the bench. And Shea on the ice, the senior. So Concord up seven to one. They're gonna finish the year 17 and one. One loss down at Pinkerton down the ice den on a Mid, what was that, early February, I guess? It was a bad Mid game. February. That was bad ice, bad game, yeah. bad whatever. It was the only time we've seen anything like that. Yeah. And they had a 3-2 a game here with uh, with Pink, uh, with uh, BG the uh, last week. Yeah, a lot of penalties in that game. A lot of stuff not called, too. But. Yeah. We're down to coming down to four and a half minutes left in the game. Running time here. Icing. And the clock continues to run even on the whistle. So Concord will play the, uh, let's see, they'll get a first round by. 8 9 will play, and then the Concord will play the winner of that 8 9 game. And then uh, they'll play the winner of the, the fourth place, fifth place teams dumped in Hushchild plays the man so Bo, the Bo, Bo will be in the playoffs but they'll be playing an away game I'm pretty sure of, uh, just squeaking into the playoff as number 11 they certainly wouldn't get a home game but uh, I think that's an improvement I think Bo was out of the playoffs last year end end action here not a lot of whistles Oh, score. There it is. Number three, Brooks Craig. Did he score? Yeah. Looks yeah. like him. Well, that was, there wasn't a lot of emotion afterwards. He just kind of was like, okay. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm sure a lot of these guys played together uh, on both teams, played together in uh, Concord Youth Hockey, being adjoining communities. Uh, 
Oh, kind of hoping he could get a shot off there, looking for a hat trick. I don't know, it says something about Brooks Craig being a freshman and making the first line. Yeah. He moved well, he was up out to that. Yeah, he was out there in the power play early on in the year as well. Yeah. So. Good player. Concord's got a good team and they're set up for the future, so. Yeah, they had, uh, I think they had eight sophomores and two freshmen and. We well, got four seniors, so 20 on the team. They're gonna certainly lose uh, the goaltender, but uh, they've always had some good goaltenders develop. We're down to one minute, coming up on one minute, 30 seconds. And they're gonna lose the newest member of the 100 point club, but. Yeah. Matt. Matt Huschild. Norton blocked that can, no, can't get it off. O'Brien centering pass. Nelson can't get a stick on it, he got a weak is. shot. Yeah. That'll be icing. One minute. A kind of a quiet crowd here. Uh, got a big crowd here. We got a crowd coming in for the girls' game later. Got some of our longtime regulars down there. Their faces look familiar. So Doherty and Huschild on the Craig goal for assists. To we'll finish this one out, most likely, because we got another whistle with 30 seconds and time is yeah, continuing is to run. Yet. So, yeah, but so this ends our 16th season. We'll be here for all the playoffs. And uh, off the posts outside. 14 seconds. A little flurry of action at the end here. Five seconds. Three, two, one. So 8-1 Crimson so Tide to seal oh. the deal on the 2019-2020 season. 17-1. and one. Bo are. ends up in 11th place, uh, just under 500. And Concord will be here next week for the playoffs. And in hopefully in two weeks, they'll be at the uh, SNHU Arena, of the, Verizon, the old Verizon. And there's our good sportsmanship handshake there. And then there's our coaches down there, the Walshes and everyone else. And Jeff Kane and Billy McDougal and it's, it's, Tim Walsh, I guess, is down there. It's pie day. Oh, Huschild went down on the handshake. <laughs> oh, they're going to go by and thank the refs. And so there's our final yeah, thank, score. Thank what was that. it? 30 to 7 on shots on goal. So I want to thank you for watching. Charlie Russell for Concord TV. Peter Burgess, I'll see you in the playoffs. Thanks for watching.